Hello everyone, it's Tom from Trout Soup. And Matt, Trout's son's dad. We're meeting Andres, Johnny, and their daughters, and my two kids, at Chins Lake. Dry dropper, We're using a pale morning gun, and a blood midge. Gassing in real close to the color change again. You will need a high clearance 4x4 vehicle to get into this lake, but it's camping right at the lake. You can fish right from your truck or Jeep. And if you're older, have children, or don't want to hike in too far, this lake is for you. It offers great high mountain lake fishing for brook trout, both Chins Lake and Sherwin Lake. And the upper lake, which is only about a 20 or 30 minute hike up a well-marked trail, offers beautiful, large cutthroat trout. I originally fished these lakes back in 1994. Both Chins Lake and Sherwin Lake were originally stocked with splake. And although the splake are no longer in these lakes, the brook trout have flourished. What colors on this guy? And all fishing is supposed to be done by, by artificial flies and lures only. Right, we just opened up that brook trout. And who says brook trout don't eat small mice? There's the eyeball, nose, and the fur. Ha! Remember when fishing with kids to make it fun. Well, this is Talon's fish here. Apparently we were never recording. If you make fly fishing fun for the kids, it'll give you that extra hour or two for fly fishing for yourself. Sometimes this means setting down the fly rod, going and hunting for bugs, or just skipping rocks. Sherwin Lake is literally located a couple hundred feet away from Chins Lake on the west side. Have a nice day. Another one? Can I go in? Yeah. Well, that's a big one too. Big one. I feel like the water's running a lot. I don't want it to break. That's okay, it's not gonna break. He's gonna bump the board at every bend. Oh yeah. Good size brook, actually. Really good size. <laughs> Look at how fat he is. For kids just learning fly fishing, handing off your fly rod to them and having them reel in a fish is a great first experience. Yeah, there are some big fish here. Fish on! Is he off? What's going on here? Bring, bring him over this way. Yeah, trout son, trout daughter's doing filming of the, uh, took the dry too. A little brookie in the bag. I cook him up. On our way up to Slater Lake, following the, the outlet stream. Bushwhacking to the Continental Divide on our way to Slater Lake. Pretty rough, huh, son? Yeah. But we found the trail now. And on up, Slater Lake. Although we decided to take the inlet stream to Sherwin Lake up and around, bushwhacking it off trail to Slater Lake. There is a well-marked trail on the north side of the dam at Sherwin Lake that leads you straight to Slater Lake. Oh, that's a beaut. Big 
big moose. Dogs are running along. He's staring me down right now. Okay, this big male moose is actually blocking our way out of here out of Slater Lake. He's standing about probably seven feet tall. Staring me down. That's a beaut. Yeah, he looks just like the one I caught yesterday. Maybe it's the same guy. Well done, son. Beaut. Inlet at Fall River Reservoir. Talon, cutthroat on the line. Yep. Alright, now watch the dog, he's right behind you. If he yep. touches fish, I'm gonna cry. Push his fins forward like I showed you? Yeah. Hi. There you go. Nice, Talon. Oh yeah, he's a good one. Okay, you want to do a release? Okay. All right, grab the net. Ready? I'm ready. Can you give me two fighting? Sometimes the releases don't go as planned, but if you show your kids the proper techniques, they'll learn. Talon, yeah. explain to us and your viewers and fans what oh, you're going to do, be doing with this perfect skipping rock. So I'm going to skip it. If okay. it's bad, it's in the video. Okay. Ready? We're ready. Oh! oh! <laughs> okay, so here's your evening report. We came up to fish Chins Lake, Sherwin Lake. We hiked up to Slater Lake over to Fall River Reservoir today. We caught boatloads of beautiful brook trout. If you want gorgeous brook trout, this is the lake. You do need a high clearance 4x4 to get up here. The upper lake has even bigger brook trout, much fewer brook trout. They were rising to dry flies today. And then we hiked up from there, which only takes about 30 minutes to get to Slater Lake, and there's some pretty large sized cutthroats in there. Unfortunately, we got chased out by a lightning storm. You saw the big moose on our way out the door. We were trying to get out of there as it was raining and lightning on us. Uh, and then we came back down here. We hiked down to Fall River Reservoir. And now we're getting ready to go do some evening fishing over here at Chins Lake. Hope you enjoyed our video today. Talon? Yeah. Goodbye from Trout Sun. Trout Sun? Yep. Goodbye from Trout Sun and Trout Soup. Hope you enjoyed our video today.